Good morning, friends. We are getting ready for St. Patrick's Day, and you might be thinking about how you could catch a leprechaun. So let's read this story by Adam Wallace, and the illustrations are by Andy Elkerton. How to Catch a Leprechaun. The night is dark, the streets are quiet. St. Patrick's Day is near. I'll tap my hammer so you'll know the leprechaun is here. I'll pull out all your laces, put glitter in your hair, and when you walk around you'll see my gold coins everywhere. You'll never catch me in your trap, but yes, I'll make a scene. I'll turn the whole place upside down. I'll turn your toilet green. House number one, I'm going in. Really, that's your trap? I'm in and out without a doubt. That one was a snap. The kiddos are trying. And now I think it's getting worse. A shoebox on a stick. I'll dance a jig and still escape. We leprechauns are quick. Another house I fixed your shoes. They were really quite smelly. I'll eat the nuts you left as bait and leave with a full belly. So they're putting food to try and catch the leprechaun. That was a good idea. And now you're talking, look at this, it's dandelion tea, but I'm too speedy for your trap. This tea is mine for free. I know you'll want my pot of gold, that iron cage was clever, but I've been alive for 20 years. You won't catch me ever. Ha, 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 ha. Now you're getting fancy, but I'll escape with twinkle toes. It's a fancy, pantsy, dancy. So they're trying really hard, but still, look at that sneaky leprechaun is escaping. It seems to me an engineer has helped with this design. Too bad this little leprechaun is going to be just fine. Oh, look, dad even helped, but no. It didn't work. Off goes that sneaky leprechaun. Your entire house is one big trap from ceiling to the floor. Nice try indeed, but soon enough, I'll stroll right out the door. And look, they added a sign, totally safe place for leprechauns. They're trying so hard. The leprechaun be gone 3000 gave me quite a scare, but without a four leaf clover, I won't be caught in there. So he says we need four leaf clovers. You'll never catch this leprechaun, impossible. That's a fact, unless one day a brilliant child designs the perfect trap. But who will that child be? And look, the kiddos have their blueprints. That's when you draw out and sketch out your ideas before trying to build it. Better luck next year, says the leprechaun. So good luck to you, boys and girls. Use your STEM journals to try and puzzle through how you can create a trap to catch a leprechaun. Good luck to you.